Hey, 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 y'all! It's Sanaya, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. to do a part two to my um, sketchbook tour um, this is gonna be a new sketchbook last time I toured this sketchbook which is like a really old sketchbook um, is a few years old now to be honest so this one's like pretty old I showed you guys like some drawings here the ones that I like yada yada so now I'm gonna actually show you guys a different one. My bigger sketchbook. And so without further ado, let's get straight into this video. When I first open up my sketchbook, I have pages from another sketchbook, okay? Uh, because the other sketchbook was trash. The things just ripped right off. So um, like I said, getting a very good sketchbook is very, very important because you don't want your pages falling out. So this picture right here, or this portrait right here, this is a portrait of my father. <laughs> this is how it's looking. I don't want that glare to come in, so I'm kind of like, you know, showing you like that. If you are new here, as a portrait of my father, this is actually another portrait. This was supposed to be a portrait of myself. However, I did not finish it. One little thing kind of bugged me about this portrait, which was like that one little lip part. This is a type of like paper. You keep on, you know, erasing, erasing, erasing. It starts to shed. So I'm like, yes, yeah, it just doesn't look as good. But I love the shading on this. I just did not finish it because that lip part. And I'm like, dang, that just messed up the whole thing. But yeah. This is another drawing that I did. Um, this is actually of a TikToker. I do not know his ass. But this is of a TikToker. I drew this. Faces is on more of like the cartoonish side, as you can see. But I really like this one. Moving on. No. <laughs> This is a page that I like. I was playing around with some color pencils here. As you can see, I got um, this girl. She's like a little punk type. Wait, hold on, right here. She's like a punk type girl. She has her like tongue sticking out. And I don't know, I just wanted to try something different, something new with like color pencils, kind of like experimental. And then down here we have these set of eyes. Those eyes I actually drew from like just my head. I was just drawing. Usually I would like use a reference on some things if I want to get like a pose down or like I'm going to draw like something from a real life thing. But for this one I drew it from my head. I just sat down and draw and I feel like when you do that, it's a little bit more free. My next one is I'm Dante from Twitch. He's a Twitch streamer and I drew him and I actually got his attention with this um, drawing. This is like the one that I'm like, realism to the top, like it eats, you know? These are actually on my page. I do a little bit of, what's it called? Like character design. I love character design. That's like my favorite element of drawing is like when I make a character and like, you know, give them some personality, some spunk to them. This was not too long ago. This one was just like, one like dearest to my heart because I just 
let go. Like, I just did this freely out of my mind. I did not have no references when it came to any of these. These are our original characters, my original OCs. Um, and I would just was challenging myself to, like, draw something new, like, new character design. This is another... It's a frog! You guys see? Nothing really can be said about this. I just drew this because I'm like... Like I said, I wanted to give myself a challenge. And I'm like, can I draw animals as well as I draw people? I don't know. Oh my goodness. I feel like this one kind of like, like wrinkled a little bit, but... Did I have like a page in here that it wrinkled it? But I was scraping hard on them color pencils drawing on my page and it is of a little beta fishy color scheme by me by the way all original colors but this is a little beta fishy that I love like I said I started to like get into experimental colors experimental um designs with color pencils You did not say that. Anyway, this is another drawing, but guess what? This is my little group drawing. This is crayon. This is not pencil. In my most recent video, I went um, decorating my graduation cap and I did groups. And he's a little small, little grooty. I'll show you guys right now, by the way. This is my graduation cap, y'all. And you see the little Grootsy right here? He's so cute. Like, and it's like glittery. I had glitter in my hair like the whole day. This whole day I had glitter in my hair. People were like, why do you have glitter in your hair? They're like, oh my gosh, I love it. Like, is that intentional? I had a lot of glitter in my hair. But um, as you can see, I love Groot. I wanted to challenge myself. Another one that I wanted to challenge that I actually did on my page as well. This is Groot, but he's made out of crayon. Moving on to one of my charcoal drawings. Da -da -da. I showed you guys a little bit of my charcoal drawings, but I didn't show you like my progress of like realism. This is one that was like bam you know it just gave bam um this is one of my realism <laughs> realism <laughs> realistic i don't know it, it is realism but i said it wrong my realistic drawings it's really nothing to like really say about this one like it eats again but i like this one too let me know what you guys think Another one of my charcoal drawings, realism. Ooh, hold on, hold on, hold on. This one I made out of pen. Actually, I need to do that challenge. If you guys want to see me make a realism drawing out of full pen, no erasing, no erasers, just balls and pens, let me know. I did them with these pens that I have over here. They're like... I had a few of my supporters say that they had these type of pens. I got them like from Michaels or something like that. It's nice. I feel like the pens that I use weren't like as best quality. But it got my point across. So if it got my point across, I love it though. <laughs> this was my sketchbook tour of my black sketchbook. Um, let me know in the comments below which one is your guy, you guys' favorite. Um, I would say my favorite out of all of them was probably Groot. I love Groot. And my realism one, the one with the like paint brushes and paints and stuff like that. Thank you guys for all the support on all my art videos. Like I can't thank you enough. Like I said, thank you guys for all the love, all the support. And let me know if you want a part three to this sketchbook tour because I have another sketchbook that I want to show you guys. It's not completed, but I have another sketchbook that I want to show you guys. So let me know if you want like a part three to this. I'm Anaya. 
this <laughs> is my sketchbook tour and I'm signing out. Peace.